Ah, uh, okay. We're connected. Let's go. Um, let's see. Zero Aura. Suicune. Mandibus. Slurpuff. Slurpuff is, like, is annoying. Heatran and Dracovish. He at least doesn't bring Sandbrush Dracovish, Dracovish, which is um, one thing. Uh, let me see. What is a good lead? Um... I can honestly, I can lead Momo and then switch into Zygarde if he leads Sarah Aura. That's an option. I can also lead Clefable and like teleport out. I think I want to lead um, Barascuda and switch into Zygarde if he leads. Yeah, that's the plan. Um, yeah, good luck, have fun to Q. Oh, I'm nervous. Like, every time I get nervous. But, like, each time a little less, I feel. Which is maybe not even a good thing. <laughs> but, yeah, we're waiting for Q to, uh, to pick his lead. Let me take a sip of my drink. Okay, let's see what he brings. I like we know what he brings. Let's see what he leads. My bad. Let me set up the calc as well. I'm leading Barrow's Gunam. Puff Puff is the slurp puff. That's great. I can dent this thing, right? Um, slurp Puff. I'd say it's belly drum. It's probably a little bit more defensive. Um, I can honestly just flip turn out, right? Question is, who do I want to go into? That's a good, good chunk. Let me see. Um, I can kind of go into Clefable, right? Should I go into this thing already? The thing is, I don't want to take a hit. Hmm, maybe I should have stayed in actually and just waterfall. Could have gone into Tentacruel as well. He T bolts. I should not have gone into Tentacruel. Okay, good thing that we went into Clefable. That didn't do a lot, and I'm Fizz Death. I'm not even Spit Death. Um, I can kind of just fire off a Moonblast because I'm not really scared of anything. He'll probably set up the webs, which is um, okay. We just need to get them away uh, as soon as possible. Yeah. I should have just straight up Waterfall, man. Nice, now the one will... Oh, he's unburdened now. Which I'm not too scared of, I have um, Aqua Jet on uh, what Shimmer called. Yeah, I'm just gonna Moonblast again. I have Aqua Jet on the... Um... Shit, what's his name? Barrascuda, I have Aqua Jet on Barrascuda. So I can always outspeed it. Um, he pulls the switch into Metro Boomin, which is the Heatran. Let's go. Um, this is gonna do nothing. We can kind of see if it's Spidef, I guess. Um, that is very little. I, and it's worth that, so I can't even tell if it's Spidef, but it probably is. Um, Heatran, especially defensive. Level 50 from my Cliff Fable set. Um, yeah. I think it's Bedev. Which means I'm not really too scared of going into uh, Zygarde. I think. Like, he can have Dragon Pulse, but even that, I'm a uh, Bedev Zygarde. So I'm not even too scared of that, I think. Like, if he Toxic, maybe he should have teleported instead of um, Heart Switching. 
And we have to remember we're playing with webs, so uh, that's a thing. He just flashed cannons, okay. Could have gone into, uh, what's it called as well, Tentacruel to spin. But I think I can just set up a substitute here because I think he's going to switch 100%. Yeah, he pulls the switch into uh, North Winds this weekend. Okay, I'm gonna um, glare this, I think. And then I can get a switch into um, Tentacruel. To, uh, to either haste, like if he's Carmine, I could haste. Um, he shouldn't be doing too much to Tentacruel with anything. Uh, but I'm just gonna glare this. He just ice beam straight up. That's a okay with me. Okay, now just go into. Um, he didn't bring uh, what should we call his ghost Pokemon Frostlass, so he doesn't have a spin blocker. So I just uh, go into um, Tentacruel and spin. Like, I wanted to bring Zapdos to Defog, but I could just only, honestly not find any plays on the team for it. Like, it's good against um, Suicune, I guess, with... Like, he has a, a full absorb one. Sorry for the para. Um, let's just uh, spin the webs away. He switches out. I can see... KitKat 2.0. Okay. That is the, um, the Zero Aura. Okay, scary stuff. Um, does a little bit of chip. Um, I can see him go for a play rough though. That's the thing, but I really do not want to stay in. So, um, I can just go back into, um, Zygarde, I feel. If he pulls off a play rough, I can go into either Tentacruel or Clefable. I think Clefable's kind of able to deal with this. Like, I think he's bringing physical... Um, Zero Aura because you shouldn't have any special moves that hit my Zygarde. Like, except for like Grass Knot. So I can see a play rough. He's Bulka. Okay. How much does a pl plus one play rough do against me? Zero Aura physical. Um, it's plus one. Wait, it's level 50. It's plus one attack, he's plus one defense, so I can see how much uh, my Zygarde set does to it. Thousand Arrow still does a chunk. Um, what if he has play rough? Play rough. 66%. Uh, I can take that. I can kind of go for a thousand arrows here. I can also glare. But I do think I just want a thousand arrows in this position. He can bulk up again. Yeah, he has the play rough, shouldn't kill. Nice. Is that life orb? That's not life orb. He has uh, Shulker, okay. That's interesting to know. Um, so what do I want to do now? Um, I can kind of go into Clefable because I think Clefables should be able to handle it pretty well. Like Plasma Fist does a lot, but he can he can't Plasma Fist on this turn. So what I can do is I can go into Clefable. Yeah, I think that's what I need to do here. He knocks off the lefties, which is all okay. That's a really good play on the switch. He didn't have to play rough again. Um, I can just Moonblast here, right? 
Or do I wish? No, I'm just prone to getting crit if I wish. I need some Moonblast. He Plasma Fists, which should do around um, 60%. Please don't crit. Nice. Like he's getting really good chip on my uh, on my team. We get a special attack drop, which shouldn't matter. Um, do I even want to pull a switch? I don't think I really want to. Do I sack Clefable or Zygarde? I need to click moves though. I I'm gonna click uh, Moonblast. Time is really stressing. Okay, so we lose Clefable to um, Zero Aura, which means we still have the Zygarde, which can be really nice. Um, I go into Momo and Aqua Jet here. Good, good. Like this should KO, it has like really little health left uh, and I'm choice banded. So we just uh, Aqua Jet. He can save this thing and go into um, like what's it called, Northern Winds this weekend. Cause this thing gives me a lot of problems, but he um, lets it go down. That's a crit that should not, like that shouldn't matter. Um, okay, great. Like, I want to calc if that matters, but it shouldn't matter, like... Um... It's rude against plus one defense. Um, yeah, Aquachet does 20% minimum. That's if, if, like, if he has no bulk, but, like, that just kills. I think letting Clefable go down was probably the best option there, because... I didn't bring Clefable for like anything specific. It was just there for wish support, which is really annoying because now I can't wish up Zygarde anymore. Um, but yeah, it is what it is. Puff Puff. Um, like it doesn't have an Unburden boost anymore, but I don't know if I KO with uh, Choice Bandit Aqua Jet against uh, Slur. Puff, level 50, Aqua Jet does, like, what if it's max bulk? Okay, that doesn't kill. Um, I can kind of, like, if he fairy moves here, that's annoying. I can go into Zygarde expecting a Thunderbolt, because I think he Thunderbolts here, right? Like, if he clicks like Dazzling Gleam, that's a um, good play on him. He webs again. Okay, good stuff. I shoot out speed. Um, if it's max speed, yeah, it doesn't have Unburden Boost. Uh, and I can just click Thousand Errors to finish it off, I guess? Question mark? Like, this kills, right? So I got Thousand Errors doesn't KO, actually. Do I still click it? I think I should. Like, if it's max defense, this shouldn't... Okay. I don't know if that's a misplay. It might fully well be. Um, okay, I just go into this thing and flip turn. I 
could have spun as well maybe with um, ten screw. Yeah, I just flip turn because I should still outspeed at minus one even. I would have liked to see Zyg I put a little like more work in game like this game. So I like I probably misplayed that. I could have gone into um Yeah, I don't know what I should have done there. He goes into Dracovish. I flip turn I go into uh Zeru right away. That's a crit. That <laughs> I'm really sorry. That still does nice chip for like four times resisted. But yeah, because of the crit, I go into his route. Every day of the week, um, he can have leech life, which is annoying. Uh, this is this is a tough position. I think I just power whip right. Yeah, he leech slice. Okay. Tough. I should have. Uh, I should have switched there. Crit doesn't matter at all. Which gives me an opportunity to rapid spin. Yeah, rabbit spin right here. Because we didn't see live warp, I think it's banded. So yeah, it's not looking too good. But like Barrow's here, they can like put in work. Is what we've seen in previous matches. <laughs> so um trying to think of an end game here. We still have uh, Eager Slash as well. If we can get someone to proc our weakness policy, we're like we're well on our way. Um, just trying to see how we deal with Man the Buzz then. Okay, great. He goes into Man the Buzz right now. Um, how much does my tentacle set do to Man the Buzz? Hydro Pump does. 37.9%. Um, I can just go for Hydro Pump here, right? Because I don't want to switch into Barrowskitter or Iggy Slash and take a foul play. He knocks off the expert belt. Like, it's, it's gonna seem really, really weird. Like, this, this sensible set is just odd. It really is. Um, but I can hydro I can put him into a position where he's forced to roost, I feel. He U-turns, okay, that's really nice, because then he, that means he has to come in um, like half health, which I'd rather have than like something between half and full. <laughs> What is this switch here? He can go... He can honestly go Suicune. But then I'll just Giga Drain. Um, he goes into the Dracovish, that's a really good play. Um, we can see right here if it's... Scarfed or if it's... Yo, Scarfed or Bandit. Um, because if it's banded, um, and I outspeed with 
What's it called? Okay, it's Bandit. <laughs> and I outspeed with um, Barracuda. I can close combat twice, I feel. He fishes Rens. Okay, we live. Good stuff. Um, yeah, I just Giga Drain again. No need to make unnecessary switches here. How much does uh, Bandit close combat do? From my Barracuda to his Dracovish. Uh, choice Bandit, Barracuda. He kills with Vicious Rent. I assume I wasn't even looking. Close combat does uh, a ton. So we go into this, we click Close Combat. You can honestly save this thing, but I think everything he wants to switch in takes a, a chunk. So we just close combat. Like, I think he lets his Draco fish go down here, because I feel his other pieces are quite valuable. Because there's not a lot on his team that, team that wants to switch into a close combat, uh, a banner close combat. Because Mandibus dies like after two guaranteed at the range it's at. Uh, Suicun takes a lot. Like he definitely doesn't want to doesn't want to switch in Heatran. I feel Heatran is what might have is what like what might are we actually withdraws. He goes into a slow path. Okay. I completely forgot he even kept that thing as a sack. But yeah. Okay, we get rid of Slurpuff as well. Um, what does he go into right now? He can do Suicune, quite honest. Like, like I don't, I don't think Suicune like does anything here for him. Um, Tracovish dies. Mandibuzz dies after two guaranteed. I think. He goes into Suicune, which is still paralyzed. Um, Suicune, subcar mind, level 50. Because honestly, might just have to go for a CC here. Yeah. Okay, that's fizz dev. That's super fizz dev. He skulls. This shouldn't kill. Like I'm, I'm at minus two spidev, so it's gonna do a lot. Please don't burn. Okay, I can go into this thing. I feel on a Skull because I don't mind getting burned on a special variant. Okay, um, do we Shadow Ball or Autotomize? We can just auto demise, right? Um, because I think he might just pull a switch. Yeah, he can go Heatran. Oh, Mandibus. Oh, how much do I do to Mandibus right now? Aegislash, slash Blade to. I'm at two minutes. So god damn it, Mandibus defensive. Level 50, Flash Cannon does, not enough. Okay, so my plan is, because Foul Play does a lot, but not to my Shield version, right? Yeah, okay, so my plan, King Shield, until it fails. So then I did take damage in Shield form, and then I can kill it with something. And then maybe, What's it called? Is able to clean up. Um, 
because I think Heatran kind of kind of kills the boss here. I'm gonna turn on my light because it's just, like it's getting dark. There you go. Light in the dark. Uh, so yeah, let's see what he does here. Because I think he might just want to file play. But he kills the roost. Roost would be super annoying. Yeah. Um, that's honestly a good play on his part. How much is plus two special attack? Hmm. Let's see. Let's just... King Shield again. Because I wanted to prompt my weakness policy, right? Foul play, okay. That's super effective. Bam, weakness policy. And now I flash cannon because I literally have no better move. Um, he's getting low on time as well. He took a he took a second to think about his uh, his last one. But man, the buzz doesn't die to anything. I just hope to put like <sighs> things. I don't think Heatran dies to a a choice banner close combat. Uh, well, maybe it does. Um, Barracuda against like Heatran. Like, it was spadef, right? It was super spadef. Okay, and he just takes me out here, because I'm plus to attack. Okay. Um, Varus Cuda, close combat to Heatran. Actually, Oko's. Um, so I think I just have to lock myself into close combat here. But I think his Suicune is still out of range. Is that my best move? Uh, I, have a, I have a wall to think about this, because I'm only going to be clicking one move from now on. Suicune, Mandibus, Heatran, Dracovish. Yeah, I have to click uh, close combat to kill, like, Dracovish, for example. So I just CC. Do I even have enough CCs to not struggle myself to death in the end? <laughs> I have five. Wait, his um, Suicune is pressure, right? I think I definitely lose here, because I don't have enough PP. Like if that would, if that actually would be the case, that'd be infuriating. <laughs> but yeah, it is what it is. Cause if I click close combat twice, like let's say this thing gets paralyzed. Let's say I click close combat twice. He trains four of my PP. Which means I have to gonna I'm gonna have to struggle everything else to death. Ah, uh, two might be able to do the trick. If he doesn't get paralyzed, but he doesn't get paralyzed. Um We don't live. Okay, GG to Q. Um I really thought that was like a slight chance I could bring it back in the end. Um but he played really well. Um so yeah, good game to Q the Costa Rican. Um, if you don't know this man yet, uh, please go check him out. His link will be down in the description. He makes super enjoyable um, Pokemon content in general, uh, draft content. Um, just super, super enjoyable man to watch. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.